Welcome back to my creative channel. In this video, I will show you how I recycled a broken 220 volt LED bulb into a solar powered bulb. You can find broken 220 volt LED bulbs in the landfill. To make sure the bulb is broken, I will use a 220 volt power source to check. Please subscribe to the channel, leave comments below the videos, and visit my channel often. Thank you very much. With this lead bulb, I can use my hands and take it apart. Next, I will remove the LED panel from the case. The LED board is really simple. It has very few electronic components. I used a soldering iron to remove the wires from the LED bar. The reason the bulb is broken and the LED bulb does not light up is due to the capacitor. I will remove the two wires from the bulb to use for the new bulb. Maybe it is easier to use scissors to cut. Next, I will remove the broken capacitor on the LED bar. I used a soldering iron to easily get it out. I smeared some tin on the point where the capacitor was removed. Then I use a MOSFET solder to the spot I just tinned. Solder carefully because the weld points are very close together. Next I took two small resistors and wound them together. I soldered one end of the resistor to one leg of the MOSFET. The other end I soldered to one leg of the diode. I will solder an additional surge arrestor into the circuit. I will add some tin to them to make them more sturdy. I will use old wire to solder into the circuit. First, Cut a short piece of wire and remove the two ends to expose the copper wire. I soldered one end to the MOSFET leg, the other end to the input power capacitor. Then I solder two wires to the input of the LED bar. Please subscribe, like, and comment below the video. Thank you very much. I use a 1.5 volt battery to power the light bulb.
Use special glue to attach the battery to the back of the LED bar. The two input wires I will solder to the battery. I soldered two more wires to the battery. Note, use two different colored wires to easily distinguish the polarity of the battery. I drilled a hole in the light bulb cover. The hole was created so that I could mount a rectangular switch in it, so the hole will be rectangular. Next, I will attach the LED bar to the case. I use special glue to attach it. And this is the switch I will use to turn the light on and off. After soldering the wire to the switch, I will install it in the created location. Next, I put the bulb cap back on. I use a small solar panel with a capacity of 1.5 volts. I will drill a small hole in the lid to thread the wire through. Continue removing the ends of the two wires to expose the copper wire. Now use your soldering iron to connect the wires to the solar panel. Do it with caution. The final step is to use special glue and attach the solar panel to the cover of the light bulb.
Finally, I made a solar-powered lamp from a broken light bulb. You can see how I did it. Isn't it great? When the battery runs out, we can recharge it by placing the bulb under sunlight. If you like this idea, don't forget to give me a like and hit the notification bell to see the latest videos. Thank you very much.